Now Steve-O preparing himself for his long stretch in the pokey for <laughs> mocking SeaWorld openly uh, on top of a very dangerous sign. Dude, there's a video of you. You were streaming live while you, you fucked with the SeaWorld sign. Would you write? Well, I, I had two different ones. I had the highway sign where I right. changed it to say SeaWorld sucks. And then there's the, the one where I climbed up the 150 foot tall crane. Yeah. Okay, but I think both of them made me shit my pants. <laughs> One of them, we were watching it. Brian and I were watching it, and my toes were curling. Oh, no, wait, like, you were watching it live? Lifting up. Yeah, we were watching it oh, at one dude, point. Weren't we best, watching man. it live? Uh, no, it was when we were in SeaWorld, uh, when you, or, I mean, San Diego, and you were doing the sign one. Oh, and right, it was right, right, when you were right. climbing up the sign, and you kept on and falling. And I kept landing on my yeah. head, yeah. Oh, dude, yeah. How did you live? <laughs> I don't know, man. That would seem to seem to that be a one made far, sense. far like, fall. <laughs> that was like appropriate. It was right there down in San Diego near SeaWorld. The highway sign said SeaWorld Drive, and I changed it to say SeaWorld Sucks. I like guess it was appropriate. My crane one was completely fucking idiotic. There is a, it's, like, it's like, okay, let me protest SeaWorld at some random construction site. Nowhere fucking near SeaWorld. You know, let me fucking bring an inflatable killer whale, like a toy whale, climb up a 150-foot crane. When you're 150 feet up in the air, nobody, no one's going to be able to see your fucking toy whale. You know, it's so They're dumb. Like, What's that dot? Right, see, yeah. It's Steve-O and a dot. I know, but then nobody could even tell. So I, by the time I get up there, I got 80 firefighters, 18 cops, a helicopter, and a SWAT team. I'm like... Yeah. The problem like, with that stuff is if something real was going down and they had put all the resources... Oh, tr trust me, I get it. Yeah. That's why I'm going to jail. <laughs> <laughs> How long are you going to jail well, for? Well, I have a 30-day sentence, but I don't think I'll... Like, I, don't think, I think they automatically cut it in half and then maybe even get out even quicker. Uh, how does that work? Do you... But I, I didn't necessarily have to go to jail at all. Like, I asked my, my lawyer to get me jail time specifically because my fucking crane stunt was so idiotic. Uh, I was like, man, I got to go to jail. That would be the only <laughs> one tiny little part of it that makes any sense at all. <laughs> because, like, if you're trying to make a statement about captivity, right, you know? Right. Put yourself in captivity. Right. That's the whole wow. deal. So I asked for it. and, and um, So you asked for jail. Like, you could have gotten out of jail? I'm sure I could have. I could have done, like, community service, like, uh, you know, whatever. Like, I was like, no, dude, because I'm a fucking attention whore. So, like, I'm like, dude, like, like scrub graffiti that is not a cool story like going to jail that's a headline you know like i'm gonna get fucking i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna get <laughs> uh, you know steve was going to jail that's a fucking that's newsworthy that's so ridiculous it's, it's, <laughs> yeah welcome to my world did you say that <laughs> did you say that to the to the judge well no i never even had to go to court because oh, uh wow. you know like they all they all worked it out so um well, they kept postponing my my arraignment and when uh the, when, you know by, by the time that like the prosecutor and my lawyer finally worked out a deal then when the arraignment was back on, they said, hey, we reached a deal, and then they closed it all down. <sighs> Have you wow. been to jail before? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I, 